Hey, Dirt Farmer Jay here from DirtFarmerJay.com. If you're a maker like I am, you're gonna add a lot of mixed numbers together to make pieces of material, whatever material you're working with. Now, you sure, if you got Alexa in your shop or maker space, you can call out and say, hey, how much is nine and 13 sixteenths plus two and five eighths? Or you can get out your calculator or construction calculator and do that. But why? When you've got what you already need right before you, a pair of rulers. Stay tuned and I'll show you a great trick you'll use over and over again. Hey, Dirt Farmer Jay here from DirtFarmerJay.com. I love great simple tricks that many people over the generations before us have used. And this is one of those tricks of using a pair of rulers to mix, uh, add mixed numbers. Now, mixed number is where you have a whole number, plus you have a fraction with it. And a lot of times those fractions end up with differing denominators. One of them may be in a 32nd, the other may be in a 16th or a quarter or an eighth or whatever it may be. And when you try to add those things together really quickly and efficiently, you can introduce a lot of error or it just can be real difficult. So look on down here. Here's a couple of fraction type of things. We're gonna let the ruler solve for us. We're gonna add seven and five eighths plus four and three sixteenths and see what we get. And we're also gonna do nine and 13 sixteenths plus two and five eighths. This also works the opposite way where I can actually subtract and you'll see what I mean, but let's just do the addition right now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna first lay down one ruler and I'm using these Woodsmith fine tools. I love these rulers, by the way, and I'll give you a link below where you can get them. Uh, but as you can see, from your vantage point, you can see the same numbers that I do. So you're seeing a four and I'm seeing a four on this side. So let's go ahead and do our first number. And that's seven and five eighths. So if I move right up here to seven and five eighths, it's right there. And I'm gonna add four and three sixteenths. So the only thing I'm gonna do is take my second ruler, I'm gonna butt it up to my first, and I'm gonna go to that seven and five eighths right there. And then I'm gonna use, I'm gonna jump to ruler two. This is ruler one. We're gonna go to ruler two. And I'm gonna use my four and three sixteenths. So I'm gonna go four plus three sixteenths. And there, go back to ruler A, and there is my answer right there. I am at 11, and I go to three quarters, but that's not right. It's actually 13 sixteenths. So 11 and 13 sixteenths. So we'll do 11 and 13 sixteenths. Not bad for writing upside down, right? And the rulers did that. Let's try it again just so we make sure this really works well. So we're gonna do that again. We're gonna go here. We've got our, our numbers we're gonna add right here. Nine and 13 sixteenths plus two and five eighths. Go to our first ruler, ruler A. Nine and 13 sixteenths is right there. And then we're gonna butt the ruler right there at nine and 13 sixteenths. And we're gonna go ahead and add two and five eighths, and I need to move that over a little bit because I'm not being as accurate as I could. There we go. I'm gonna go two and five eighths right there, and there's my answer right there. It is 12 and seven sixteenths. So we're gonna put that down and do 12 and seven sixteenths. Now you can do the opposite as well. If I was subtracting out nine uh, or two and five eighths from nine and 13 sixteenths, I could do the same thing. I could just go, let's go nine and 13 sixteenths and put two and five eighths on that nine and 13 sixteenths right there and go backwards and then I get my answer over here. It's pretty spiffy, isn't it? Well, these great historical tips really serve us well in the modern maker shop. If you have a tip like this that you'd like to share, feel free to do so in the comments below. Also, check out the description below where we'll provide you some helpful links for materials and other places you can go that'll help your understanding or utility of this. And if you found this video to be helpful, won't you like it? And even better yet, please subscribe to our channel. And when you do, ring the bell, and that way you'll be notified immediately, approximately every Friday, of great video content that's helpful around the home, Maggie's Kitchen, the maker next door, truck life, out in the garden and in the shop. Until the next time, this is Dirt Farmer Jay with my new calculator.